Hello, my name is Joey, and today I will be basically showing you how to make a sphere out of buckyballs. Like the last video, this ship contains 216 magnets. And if I wanted to be a little bit more specific on what to give this shape the name, I would call it the icosahedron. If you don't know what an icosahedron is, it's basically a three-dimensional shape, a little more descriptive, of 20 triangles um, folding on each other to make a sphere. So that's basically what the tutorial is for today. So let's get straight into it. So the first thing that you need to do is to make all of your magnets into a line. Next, you count down nine magnets, just like this, and then take this end and fold it to that end. After that, take it off your strand. So now you have a nine ball circle. So now we are going to transform this into a triangle. So what you want to do is grab the end and just pinch these three magnets just like that. And now, you see these two little beads hanging out? All I have to do is just push, and also make sure you're holding with the other finger. So just push these inside of the triangle. So now you'll come up with this. So now all you have to do is basically make more of these triangles. Make sure you have 20. Alright, so I just figured out that you actually don't need 216 as long as you can make 20 of these 9 ball triangles. So what, what you do with all these triangles is basically you just connect them just like that. Alright, so it means the first thing that you're going to do is attach 5 around in a circle. Just like that. And don't fill in this space because we need to curve this to make it right. So that means all you have to do is pick it up. And just fold it so now as you can see it's bended so that's how it's gonna form the sphere so the next thing you need to do is to get ten of these triangles and just put them like this all right so when you're done with all the ten triangles that means you just take this end and this end and connect them just like this. So now put that to the side and make one more of these units with the, re with the last five. And now with your two units and this, so now basically you take this and just stick it on. So just stick it on one of these triangles, just like that, and just roll it alongside, and then it should click right into it. So I basically just put this on the other side. Make sure you do it right. So that means all you gotta do is attach one of them. And now it should just snap on automatically, and here is your sphere. So I really hope you liked that tutorial, so please leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.